try do it while you've got free shipping it just makes it you know it just makes sense now we're going to get it started um, with a gentleman who has come to us here at HSN. We're very happy to have him. His name is Coach Joe, and many of you may know him. Um, and for 27 years, he really um, recruited and motivated the players on the field, but he also had a passion for food, and we get to all benefit from it. <laughs> Coach Joe, thanks for being here. I'm glad to be here, Tamara. I'll tell you, this I'm is looking gonna, forward to this it This is going to be fun. This is going to oh, be yeah. good. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. The halls are smelling amazing, and it's because of what we're starting off with. Now, we've got a few different things that we're going to share with you from Coach Joe, but we're starting off with breakfast. And do you see what we have here? This is Coach Joe's waffle stackers, and you're getting eight of them. You just decide which flavors you want to start your day off with. And if you can't decide, take advantage of the free shipping and go ahead and get a few. We have the Southern Fried Chicken Waffle Stackers. We've got the Bacon, Egg, and Cheese Waffle Stackers. We have Sausage, Egg, and Cheese Waffle Stackers. Or the Spicy Fried Chicken Waffle Stackers. You're getting eight no matter which uh, flavor you choose. But ooh, look now, at Tamara, this. Now, Tamara, let me tell you what we did now. Okay, tell me. You know, when you recruit, you gotta go get the best of everything. Mm -hmm. So I went, this is our Pork, Bacon, Egg, and Cheese Waffle Stacker. Now, what we did, we found a nice bacon round so that the, it's all together. Okay. Now we found the best bacon, the best cheese, yeah. and we put that pearl sugar waffle with that thing that you don't need any syrup. Ooh. And so <laughs> it's really delicious. So you get the nice savory of the bacon. Yeah. And then you get the chick, the cheese and oh the waffle. Oh gosh, in every bite. Right, right. Because just, you know, we know with everything, the result is gonna be better if you start off with the best. And that's what you've done. Now, and now, now here we go now. We got sausage, egg, and cheese. Now check that sausage out. Mm. Now, we didn't get a little piece of sausage. We got a big piece of sausage. <laughs> now, what's nice is you can put this in the microwave mm -hmm. or you can put it in the oven. Okay. And the nice thing about it is, if you're in a hurry, you can take it to work, pop it in the microwave a few seconds, yeah. and you're ready to go. Yes. Now, another thing is, we talked about going to the beach on vacation mm -hmm. when the buffet is $25, $30 a person. <laughs> That's right. Well, this way, you don't have to do that. You can just pop these in the oven, mm -hmm. And you're ready to go now. And that's the, and the thing is, it's a full meal. You're getting your waffles times two because you've got one on the top and one on the bottom. You've got your meat on the inside, whether it's chicken or the bacon or the sausage. And then you have your cheese. You've got your egg. It's the whole deal. Ooh. Now, this one is a southern favorite, chicken okay. and waffles. Mm -hmm. So what we did, we went up to North Georgia, chicken capital of the world. Let's see. And got the best <laughs> chicken patty we could find. Oh. Oh my gosh. Now, you gotta try one of these. I've gotta things. try yeah, you gotta, I wanna, yeah, I wanna try the, yeah. You gonna try the chicken I wanna try the chicken. Right, cool. That's all right, because right. I know that's what you're thinking, right? Yeah, because you gotta taste something now, because yeah. you know we always have a saying at Coach Joe's. We what? say, take a bite and get your mind right. <laughs> so you go ahead and you try that right there I'm and tell them what you it. think. I'm gonna do it. So this is the southern? Southern fried chicken. Fried chicken. Yeah. I'm okay. saving the best one for last. Okay, can right. I use, I, I know you gave me a fork. Yeah, use, use your hand, fingers? please, please. I just, I was trying to be etiquette, you know, but. Because <laughs> this is how we're gonna do it at home. Please use your hands. So what you think? <laughs> you got the so you got the savory chicken, the sweetness of the waffle, mm -hmm. and it's all put together in one bite. Does it mean something when you start dancing? <laughs> Absolutely now. I mean, yeah. oh my gosh, it's good. You, you gotta have official taste testers now. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Now we going you gotta so try good. this. You gotta try this one though. Okay. Now this is spicy fried chicken. Now the beauty of this is, the spice will be the last thing you taste. Okay. So what happens is. You taste the flavor of the chicken, mm -hmm. the flavor of the waffle, and then the spice comes on you later. Mm -hmm. It's kind of like a back note, yeah. which makes you want to eat some more. Okay. <laughs> so you try that piece right there and okay. tell me what you think. So I just ate the southern fried chicken, yeah. and this is the spicy fried yeah. chicken. And you kind of let me know when the spice comes on. Okay. But at first, you're going to taste mm -hmm. chicken, waffle, and then that spice. And then you're gonna take another bite. I don't know which one I like better. I, I, I know. I got I know. the spice. I just I got it. Ooh, right at good. the end because you don't want it up front right. because it'll turn you off. Right. So this way it comes on at the end. Mm. Oh my gosh! It's gonna be hard. To, it's gonna be hard to choose which one you want. <laughs> but you're getting eight of them. 
they all come individually packaged and wrapped, and we're gonna show you how to prepare yeah. these. And you just decide whether you want, they're all top and bottom with waffles. The one you see right there is your sausage, egg, and cheese. The one we've got right here is your bacon, egg, and cheese. And then you have your southern fried chicken or your spicy fried chicken. If you already know which one, then I hope that you'll call or go to hsn.com, because this is the only place that you can get these. Now, let me tell you a little about the technology. Okay. What we did was, it'll come in a ovenable microwave bag. And what this does is give you the option of microwave or oven without taking it out of the bag. Okay. So this way, it has some little small holes yeah. that allow you to use both, and then you don't have to worry about taking it out or wrapping a napkin, stuff mm -hmm. like It cuts down to time. Okay. So you can just pop this in the microwave for yeah. a minute and 20 seconds and you're ready to go. And, you're, and you've got a, again, you've got a full, full meal. Full meal, full meal. Because really, who has the time, especially now it's back to school, you've got to get, you've got to get your family fed, you know, dressed and out the door and on the way to school. And who has the time to sit there and prepare sausage and then in a separate pan, prepare your egg and then in a separate, you know, pan, make your waffles, and then put it all together. Coach Joe has already done it for you, and he's literally sourced the best of ingredients. I mean, think, can you imagine having to cook mm. eight eggs, mm -mm. eight sausages, <laughs> no. cheese, and make eight waffles mm. for everybody? Every morning? Every morning. And then clean up? Right. And well, then see, go to work? Yeah, no, it's yeah. not gonna happen. But this way, you can just kinda, I know in the mornings on the weekends, you know, mm. if you have sleepovers, and I have girls, and. Mm -hmm. They have their friends over. Well, this way we can get everybody fed in less than 30 minutes in the oven. This is so good. And and it's the kind of food that we want to eat. You know, cold cereal is not appealing. And as the weather starts to change and it starts to get, like even now, it's rainy outside. It's kind of dreary sometimes in the morning. This is what you want to wake up to. It's warm. This, I mean, it just smells. Like I said, the whole hallway here at HSN just smelled like cheese and eggs and waffles. <laughs> Just the best, the best. Well, also, too, as I said before, you're rushing to work mm -hmm. and you don't have a lot of time. So instead of just having a cup of coffee, mm -hmm. you can have a waffle stacker right. at your office and just pop it in the microwave. A minute and a half and you're ready to go. You're not stopping off for fast food. No. You're not, you know, kind of just eating just whatever you can grab. This is great. And the idea is it's all in one. It's, it's a complete meal. You can take this with you, and we're saying you know breakfast because you typically think waffles for breakfast, but this can be for your snack. This can be for when the kids come home from school and they just want a little right. something. If you're working third shift late at night, you yes. can take it with you. Oh my God. And have chicken and waffles. I know, the spicy, again, I'm eating the spice that just kicked in, it's so good. All right, this is just the beginning. Coach Joe has brought along a couple of other things too, but I wanna make sure if this is what you've been looking for, it's 090977, that's the number. Choose your flavor and we'll send it right on out to you. Now, let me share with you. We have a way for you, and come on, let's walk on over here. We have um, our HSN card, and our HSN card gives you a lot of extra benefits, but if you don't have it yet, you're missing out on those benefits. All you have to do to get one is call us or go to hsn.com to apply, and when you're approved, you can take $10 off of the very first purchase that you make when you use that HSN card. All right, we are talking hot dogs now, and when it comes to football, <laughs> I mean, they, they go hand in hand, Coach Joe. Absolutely. So Coach Joe has, has brought to us, I tell you, these are two ounce, 32 of the juiciest hot dogs ever. They're all beef, but not all hot dogs are created equal. Oh, no. And you know, I was waiting for this moment. Because <laughs> uh, one thing we do have is a good hot dog. Okay. Now, what we do, I went to a company been around 100 years. Mm -hmm. And we said, we want our hot dog to be made different. Yeah. We don't want our beef emulsified. We want it nice and chopped up like real meat. Mm -hmm. And then we don't want any nitrates. We want a clean label. And so what we did was we came up with Coach Joe's hot dog. Okay. Now, this is our two ounce size. Now, what I want to show you about our hot dog is this. Most time when you eat a hot dog, see how rough cut that is? Yeah. See, so that lets you know the meat is not emulsified. Yeah. It's not real smooth texture. It's a nice, 
rough cut. Okay. So when you take a bite, it's just like eating meat. Okay, okay. But the beauty of it is, for parents and everybody else, it's nitrate free. So it's a it's clean a product. Mm -hmm. It's all natural, you have an all natural seasoning blend. Mm -hmm. But what we're gonna do right now, mm -hmm. I'm gonna cut a piece and then okay. I want you to just take a bite plain now. Okay. Plain, no mustard, no ketchup. <laughs> and I just want you to tell me what you think. Okay. Cause you said you like hot dogs. I do, so I just I want do. you to, mm. just tell mm. me what you think. First off, I love the snap. Right, and I it's skinless. Mm -hmm. So there's no skin, even though it has a nice snap, it's just mm. when you use quality meat, you get a quality product. You know, you know how sometimes when you eat a hot dog and it's just you don't know what's in it and you kind of have to eat a few just to kind of get the, you know, kind of get a filling taste. Because this is all meat, because this is the way that it's been cut, it's filling. I mean, you put, you eat this and if you want to eat it plain, you can. If you, we dress some up so that you can get an idea of it. This is going to be that hot dog that you, that you reach for. This is good. Well, I just wanted to get your opinion now. Mm. Now, we Ooh, got a lot yeah. of ways you can do this. I mean, you got it as, you know, our regular traditional mustard, ketchup, mm -hmm. chili cheese, just plain mustard. Yeah. Now, one thing we did for parents with kids. Now, all kids like mac and cheese. Mm -hmm. So check that out. We got some nice mac and cheese with Coach Joe's hot dog. Oh, that's so good. So what do you think? We got it cut up real small. Mm-hmm. But once they take a bite now, they're gonna get their mind right, you see, so. <laughs> see, I like that. Now, we also did a pig in a blanket. Now, mm -hmm. we also have our larger hot dog okay. um, online for sale, mm -hmm. and this is our jumbo set. But what I wanted to do, since this was already ready, mm -hmm. I just wanted you to see the inside of that you thing. see that? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Look at all the meat that you've got right, in there. Right, right. I mean, that's all again, beef. Now, do we need to take a bite of this pig in the blanket? I mean, <laughs> I mean, since we're here. We might as well take a bite. We, we might as well I mean, take a bite. I might as well get your opinion of it, you know, so <laughs> you won't take my word for it. Because this is the thing. All of your food is all taste tested by honest people who will tell you the truth. Trust me. <laughs> I have two weeks of taste testing. Mm -hmm. One is my wife <laughs> and the other is my partner's wife and mm -hmm. they are Brutal. Mm -hmm. I mean, they will tell you yes or no. Mm -hmm. And the thing is, being a football coach, you're used to people telling you what to do anyway in the stands. <laughs> so with that two weeks of taste testing, it's either going to be thumbs up yeah. or thumbs down. That's right. And my daughters and their friends, so what we do, we try to get everybody involved to get their opinion. Mm -hmm. Because one thing about ladies and girls, they don't care if they're married to you or love you, if they don't like it, is over. They're gonna tell you. That's right. See, so, the fellas will just say, oh yeah, oh, yeah, yeah, man, yeah that's, good. that's good, that's good. good. But, but they don't, be, no, no, no. We'll be honest. My wife is brutal. No, I'm, know, I'm is. the same way. And it's really good. And I've had a lot of hot dogs in my day. I used to go to, you know, go to the games just to eat the hot dogs. I wasn't yeah. even watching the game. Yeah. But, so, so it makes a difference when it's this good. It makes a difference. And these are the kind of things that we think about this time of year. It's fall, you might be going to football games with your kids. And these are just easy, but they're, it's a good meal when you eat it. And there's so many different ways yes, yes. To, to eat these. And I really love the pig in the blanket because that's one of my favorite. Mm -hmm. But you can either do it with the big one or the small one. Mm -hmm. And they're going to all come here right. individually packed. And the nice mm -hmm. thing about it, you can cook them from frozen. Okay. So if you want to just take them and pop them in the oven from frozen and mm -hmm. wrap up the rest, you can do that. Mm -hmm. Or you can put them on the grill. But they're so versatile because you don't really have to thaw them out. And that's good. And you're getting 32 of them, but they Absolutely. come in packages of eight at of a eight. time. Yeah. So you wouldn't have to you know, unthaw all of them just to get a few right. out. Right. And so you're getting four packages of eight that you see right here. You'll even notice that these are nice and long. I like that too. So they go the, le the length of right. the bun, your right. typical right. hot dog bun. And these are gonna be your typical hot dog size. They're two ounces each. If you did want the jumbo size, um, because maybe it's you know it's you or your hubby who likes, you know, likes the big dog, we do have those on hsn.com and you can check that out. Now this is a, something that's a little different. This is our crowd. Okay. Now this is a bad thing now. So okay. we want you to taste just a little piece with okay. that crowd. Okay. Oh, this is See good. What you think. Yeah, yeah. I know some people are like, yeah, that's how I eat it. Right. Okay, here we go. Now tell me what you think. With that combination, you're gonna get the nice, savory hot dog and the sweet, mm -hmm. crunchy crowd. Mm -hmm. I don't know now. <laughs> I don't so know. Bad. I don't know what we think. 
It's, I mean, it's all good. You can't go wrong. I've never had. Um, oh, this is yours, Coach Joe's. That's oh, what now, you, you created. Know we were gonna, you know we weren't going to put anything else on it now. You know, we had to put our crowd on it. I mean, oh my God, that's good. <laughs> what? That's oh, yeah, good. it's different. Yes, it is. It's very it's got different. A sweet to it. Yeah, and a nice crunch. Yes. That way, it's not mushy because the hot dog's not mushy. Right. So you don't want to have. You want a nice combination with the hot mm -hmm. dog being that savory flavor. Mm -hmm. That kraut kind of offsets it like the sweet and savory waffle. And it makes sense too, because like you said, you start off with the best of ingredients. So you Correct. don't want to start off with a great a great no, hot dog and then no, just put no, something, no, no. just any old thing on top oh, of no, it. Oh no, we don't do that now. It's yeah. just like recruiting. You get ball players mm -hmm. that can play. So you don't have to worry about stuff when you have players. Mm -hmm. So these are our ball players mm -hmm. right here. You know, our hot dogs are our players. That's the whole team right there. That's right, that's right. Let me right. ask you real quick. Sure. So I'm getting 32 of them. I get four packages of eight the way they come right here. Correct. Do I pop them in the freezer when I get them? They'll Home? come frozen. Okay. They'll come frozen. And the nice thing about it is, all you gotta do is just take some out. My wife will take out. Again, you don't have to throw them out to cook them. Okay, that's, that's Which good. Which is really nice. My yeah. daughter loves hot dogs, so mm -hmm. when she wants one, yeah. we just take one out keep the rest in the freezer, put it in the oven frozen, mm -hmm. and doesn't take any time. And then how long will these, you know, how long will they last in the freezer? Frozen, you have one year shelf life. Okay. Yeah. That's good. And as we say, from the freezer. And you can see all the different, these are just a few examples of what we did with the hot dogs. I would also, um, you know, incorporate them into just your everyday snack, your everyday meal. You can see that when you have, when you're starting off with the right ingredients, when you're starting off with all beef, which is what these are, there are no nitrates and nitrites, which is a big deal. We know that when it comes to hot dogs, that's what we we don't want in them. And I like that you don't have them in these. No, no, and I mean, that's important because, you know, you are what you eat. Mm -hmm. And it's not, it, and there's no problem with not having them in it. Mm -hmm. And a lot of people read labels. Mm -hmm. So we want to make sure that when the customer reads our label, they know what they're getting. That's and our, the label's clean, but trust me, when you take a bite now, mm -hmm. you got to get your mind right. It's all, that's, that's the whole difference. This is the thing. Right. When you find something good, you will, this is what you, you savor. This is what you what, what um, makes your mouth water when you have something like this. And I know you'll try it when you get it home. Order it today. You can call us or you can go to hsn.com. We'll send it out to you. It's going to come frozen, and you're going to get all four of these packs that you see right here. Eight in each one. Get them home, break one open, and try it out and see the difference. And this is the deal. When you open it up and you oh, yeah. can see yeah. that it's not like just... Kind of oh, no, no, no. And remember, we always say take the first bite plain. Now, that's what we want everybody to do. Yeah. Just for us, when you get that hot dog in your house, don't put anything on it first. Mm -hmm. I want you to take the first bite plain so you can see the quality of the hot dog. Mm -hmm. That's what we want you to do. Yeah, and you will notice it from the first bite. And if you feel like you are a hot dog connoisseur, you're like, I know a good hot dog, and I don't, I'm a little skeptical. That's okay. Get it home. We're going to head on over. All right. Get, get it home. Try it out. Be skeptical. Be, do a taste test of your own, and you'll see the difference that Coach Joe makes. So, love that. Okay, so we started off with breakfast, right? With the waffle stackers. Then we had the hot dogs. Oh my gosh. Now we've got wings. Oh, this, this is football food. This is fall food. Oh, when yeah. I look at this, I just think. <laughs> Uh, you know, how many can I eat? Let me tell you, you're getting five pounds of the jumbo wings. And, and I do mean jumbo. These are not some skimpy little wing. We've got these for you today. They are exclusive. You can only get them here. And they come just like you see. And then you can pop them on a, you know, like an indoor grill and cook them up. Well, you know football season now. Wings mm -hmm. are the number one consumed thing from now mm -hmm. through the Super Bowl, right. through basketball. Yep. But this is the deal. Mm -hmm. Now, we got Coach Joe's Hickory Smoke Jumbo Wings. Now, when I say jumbo, yeah. I'm going to take two of them out and put them in my hand. Okay. They're going to be a little hot, Be but careful. You know, yeah. I'm tough. You know, my <laughs> wife always called me hardcore, you know? <laughs> okay. So what I want you to do is look at the two wings in my hand. How big I just want that? you to look it up now. 
Because Coach Joe has big hands. Yeah. I just want now, you to know now, that. But what I want you to do next is, you know, I want you just to twist it mm -hmm. and just uh, look Ooh, at the meat in that thing. Now, see, so we is. didn't get any baby wings. Now, these are jumbo wings. Wow. So look at this drumstick now. You just take the meat off that thing. Mm hmm You can make a sandwich with two wings. Yes, you can. You know? But now, most people like to eat it with their hand and dip it. So, mm -hmm. but what we did was, we, we season it with our all-purpose seasoning mm -hmm. and smoke it, and then we flash freeze it so they all come individually frozen. Okay. So you can take out one at a time. You don't have to throw out the whole bag. You just take out what you want, mm -hmm. and you can cook them from frozen or thawed. Okay. Now, the beauty of it is, if you want them crispy, you cook them maybe 40 minutes at 400. If you want them like this, mm -hmm. you cook them 30 minutes at 400. Okay. But the beauty is, they're gonna all be consistent. They're gonna all have great flavor. And you can use your own dipping sauce because okay. one thing about sauce, everybody likes different sauce. Mm -hmm. So we don't put sauce on them, so that way you can pick what sauce you like. That's right. Uh, right. And one other thing that I always study mm -hmm. is this. <laughs> If you ever go to a club or at a bar and people eating chicken wings, and you see a lady with some nice wings, nice, nice nails, mm -hmm. she's not gonna get that stuff in her nails. <laughs> However, by having no sauce on these wings, yeah. she can just take some nice barbecue sauce, our smoked cherry, mm -hmm. and you can just dip it. That's right. You don't have to worry about messing up your hands. How perfect is that? You know? And then, you, so, because yeah. everybody is so particular about, about their sauce. sauce yeah. Right. Depending on where you live, mm -hmm. some people like vinegar, some mm -hmm. people like mustard, but if we put sauce on them, we kind of take ourselves and put it in a block. That's right. So this way, you have the choice of whatever you want. That's right. You know, but the nice thing about it is, you can eat them plain. Now, what we're gonna do is, I want you to go ahead and. Uh, okay. Yeah, because we're gonna. Uh, we're gonna do a little taste test. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Right? Gonna, yeah, I want you just to go ahead and. Uh, okay. Tell me what you think. Okay. And let me see, and let me just draw your attention right over here. These are the wings. You're getting five pounds of the jumbo wings, right? Right. And so, eat as many. <laughs> just eat a couple. Eat the whole thing. Get ready now. Get ready. I'm, I'm just gonna take the fifth on this. Mm. <laughs> so you get a nice flavor, so but not good. overpowering. They're nice and tender. They don't even need sauce. No. Because they're already seasoned. No, and that's how we want to make stuff because that way you have options mm. doing what you want to do. Some oh people like blue cheese, some people mm -hmm. like ranch, but you can't make people do what they don't want. Mm -hmm. But well, they're gonna eat these wings. You can have a meal in a cup of wings. You'll need about four, and you got a full course meal. And that's again, that's the thing because these are jumbo. Right. You've eaten wings. You've probably eaten a plate of wings, a dozen wings, mm -hmm. just to kind of try to get the flavor for it. These are so big, and there's so much meat on each one. Yeah. Look at that. I mean, it's as juicy and as it can be. very versatile, because this is what you can do also. I have a lot of friends that have air fryers. Uh -huh. Well, you can put them in the air fryer, and they'll come out just like they were fried. Crispy, nice and quick from frozen. Mm. But again, I just want you to look at all the meat on these wings. Wow. I mean, there's so much meat, sometimes I might have to have a knife to cut them. Mm -hmm. But just look at that drumstick right there, <laughs> and just look at the meat on it. Oh my gosh. You know, <laughs> and the size of it, you see? And that's what we try to do. When we say jumbo wings, we mean jumbo wings. Wow. You know, and that's that's how we want it. These are amazing. I'm, I'm sitting up here licking my fingers. Oh, well, you <laughs> might, I might have to so get you good. another one. I might, so good. You might need to try another one. Remember, you know what I'm saying? Just just so we you know make sure you taste just it. Just to right. make sure I got it right. Yeah, this, make sure you got it right. Yeah. I didn't even have any sauce because I didn't need it. Like I said, these are seasoned so well. You, when you take a bite, you're taking, you're biting all meat. You're not biting into the bone, right? And just trying to work around the bone. We've all seen that. Yeah. You're getting five pounds of them. They come frozen. And the shelf life on this is how long? One year frozen. Okay. But you know what? They're not going to last. Not gonna they're last. not going to last. They're not even going to last a month. <laughs> right. It might not last a week. <laughs> That's right. You know, it depends on who you are. But again, you mm -hmm. can take this to your tailgate, mm -hmm. put them on the grill. And yeah. even if you want to, you don't have to give us any credit. You can just tell people, oh, man, uh, yeah. I've been smoking these wings all day. <laughs> so good. <laughs> yeah, because some of my friends, yeah. they say, Coach, we don't give you any credit. <laughs> Like, what do you mean? He said, when we put them on our smoker, we just tell them we did it. Yeah, that's okay. 
And it's all right, as but you know. As long as you know where they came from. As long as you know. And you That's can right. always come back and get more. Correct. These Correct. are exclusive to HSN, so you can't get them anywhere else. But Nowhere the best part else. is that we'll deliver them directly to you. Just call us or go to hsn.com. Say, I want the wings. No. And if you want more than a few, you know, more than five pounds, get a few of them. We'll send them right on out to you, and you're going to be licking your fingers just like I now, was. Now, one more thing I want you to do now. This is a smoke maraschino cherry. Oh. So try that with that wing. Tell me what you think. Oh my God. I could I could drink that with a with a with a straw. Well, oh my gosh, that was good. Well, of course we had to have our own dipping sauce. You know we, you know we had to have the maraschino oh, cherry. Oh, that was so good. It's uh, pretty good, huh? I'm gonna say this. My mom's gonna get mad because I think my mom has the best barbecue sauce in the world. <laughs> oh. Mom, I didn't Mom, say it now. Coach I'm, Joe. I'm taking the fifth. I'm taking the fifth. <laughs> you got to run for your money on that one. That's I'm really good. I'm taking the fifth good. one. That's yeah. amazing. Smooth doesn't overpower the chicken. Yeah. Because again, everything you do, you want to taste the protein first, mm -hmm. the seasoning or the sauce second, yeah. not the sauce first. Right. So the sauce and the season enhances the product, mm -hmm. not overpower the product. Okay, let me share this with you too, because you can get these once or you can get them on auto ship. A lot of you who are calling in are getting them on auto ship because you can already see that these are different for, for, from the wings that you see out there. You understand, if you, if you love hot, you know, um, chicken wings, then you know that there are some that are just kind of not worth it and then there are some that you will, you will find a way to get them. These are the ones. We'll deliver them directly to you. I want you to try them out. And you always, even with food, you have an unconditional 30-day money-back guarantee. Try it. If it's not what you want, send it back. I don't think you will, though, because they are so delicious. And you mentioned, you know, they're not, you didn't put the sauce on them. No. Because some people will smother and try to cover right. less than you ingredients. Right, because you can with, cover you know, yeah. anything with, with something people don't know any different. Yeah, yeah. So you want your product to perform plain. That's right. Because that's the judge of a great product is, can I perform with nothing on it? Mm -hmm. It's just like a football player. They can perform. And we coach, we had players. And again, this is one of our players here. Mm -hmm. So we just wanted to introduce you to our players. <laughs> you know, our, our wings. These are amazing. Remember, for 27 years, Coach Joe was a football coach recruiting. And part of that though, and really kind of getting to know people and developing a rapport, a lot of times that does happen in the kitchen around the dinner it table. It does, We used to cook. A lot of my players would come over my house and eat. Oh, Coach, we hungry, so I always cook for them. And I still see them now today. Yeah. They come out to my store and yeah. have tastings and things like that. Or they tell me to come for the tailgate. Then yeah. I have to do all the work. And then you have to, can you bring oh, those yeah. things? <laughs> they invite me to the tailgate and then yeah. they make me work. Right, but it's a compliment. Oh yeah. They love it. I told them I'm supposed to be on vacation. <laughs> Coach Joe, <laughs> well, we're glad you're not. We're glad that you're sharing your food with us. We thank you so much for being here. And um, again, whether it was the waffle stackers, whether it was the hot dogs, whether it was the chicken wings or the spices, check hsn.com for those or the sauce. Um, definitely, definitely shop with Coach Joe. We love it. Thank you so much. Thank you. I'm all good <laughs> for my midnight snack there. All right, we've got more for you coming up in this hour here at HSN as we're in the kitchen. Okay, so now that we have had our meal, right? You might want a little snack. And that's where Ferris comes in. Hello, my friend. Hello. Carrie Mileto is joining us. And Carrie is so, um, it, this is amazing. We've got it this day only. She's brought back the favorite from Ferris um, Company. This is the, um, these are the, the nuts and the berries. This is what we love. What you're getting are three jars, three one pound jars. So you're getting three pounds of your choice of the berry and nut mix. Yep. We're gonna go through and tell you your options. But what you'll notice is that these aren't just like trail mix that you find in the grocery store. Ferris does it better. And that's why it's a this day only, but that's why it takes us a while to really be able to bring you the configurations that you've been wanting. So let's yes, jump in. I know, let's jump in. So you have some amazing choices. Mm -hmm. Ferris has been in business since 1924 and, and the reason is right here. It's all about the ingredients. So let's break down the first one that most people get would be our roasted salted cherries, berries, and nuts, right? Okay. So roasted salted cherries, berries, and nuts. What does that have? So you have roasted salted almonds, 
roasted salted cashews from okay. India and Brazil. Check out these pecans. Our oh, pecans yes. are from Texas. The these nice, pecan. perfect, nice, big pecans. You're going to get your cherries and you're going to get your cranberries. And this is going to make up your cherry berry mix. So you can get this roasted salted or you can get this raw and mm -hmm. unroasted. And unsalted, and un yeah. Un unsalted, correct. Mm -hmm. I said that thing twice, didn't I? Okay, <laughs> it's 2 a.m. Okay, so anyway, so those are the two choices that you have, and then you can say if you wanna auto ship it, right? Yeah, you and can it, get it on auto ship. Or, or if you wanna just get it one time. Hmm. So that's it, and, and really it's raw or roasted. Yeah. It's really that simple. That's really, yeah. Yeah, and and you know, it really just kind of depends on if you want, because we know that the benefits of, of having nuts and, and the quality of that. So if you really want all of that, go for the raw. If you like a little bit more of a crunch yeah. and a little bit of the savory, go for the roasted. And you know, you'll see the difference in the roasted cashew versus the raw cashew and that sort of thing. So my, I love raw, my mm -hmm. husband loves roasted salted. So mm -hmm. maybe your household may be a little split like that, or maybe you're all the same. You can't go wrong, even our roasted salted is very lightly dusted, yeah. I like to say it that way and the reason is because we're not hiding flavors in any of our ingredients mm -hmm. we're just enhancing them so don't be afraid to mm -hmm. go roasted salted if you're thinking about that but if certainly your thing is raw just like me I love raw because these are such amazing nuts and amazing fruits that just tasting them straight up for me is yeah. so delicious yeah so but a lot of us like that little bit of a kick at the end. So either way, you're good to go. Um, I wanted to break down a little bit too about what makes our nuts and, 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 and fruits a little different. And, and talking about the fruits, you know, cherries is not something that you normally find in many mixes in the store. Mm -hmm. In fact, in most mixes in the store, and I, I, I brought one with me, uh, we find raisins. And when I put a cherry next to the raisin from the store, this would be the difference that you're seeing right there. Oh my gosh. So, you know, yeah, you know, and we, even our raisins at Ferris look just like our cherries in the sense that they're very, very big. And what we do that I can talk about that I, you know, I'm not sure what goes on over here, but I'll tell you here, we do not send our juice to concentrate. Mm. We are sure to keep everything inside. And when we dry our fruits, we can actually tear into them. I can rub them on my hands mm. and there's actually juice. You now see oh. the coloration and the juice yeah. on my fingers. Mm -hmm. That is a completely different experience in this guy right here than this guy right here, which a lot of the times they take the juice out, mm -hmm. they'll send it to concentrate, mm -hmm. and then what you're getting is kind of like what I like to call like fruit jerky. Yeah. So it's kind of like you go, that kind of tastes like a whatever, you <laughs> right. know? And, it, right. and that's the idea because really they're just kind of putting in fillers and they're giving you a couple good nuts or something and then they fill it with the rest. Mm -hmm. So being able to know that with Ferris you're getting all of the highest ingredients, the highest quality, again, since 1924, mm -hmm. we do business in a way where we want you to have the best the most high quality, the most juicy, and or the most crunchy nuts. And they come in the three pound containers because we want them to stay as fresh as possible for you. For sure. And so we were just showing you the cranberry and cherry option. Yes. There's also a cranberry and blueberry option as well if you would rather have blueberries than cherries. So we have fewer of those available, but just so you know, we do have them available right now. You get them one time or get them on auto ship and I just want you to understand exactly what you're getting mm -hmm. all three of these all three. these are a pound each yeah. i ordered them on auto ship uh once for my husband yeah thinking oh well you know it'll by the time we're empty you know the next shipment will be there he ate them so fast. Okay. That's what happens. <laughs> he said, These are good. That's what happens. Yeah. Well, you know, what's so exciting about this is it's nature. So think about it. So this time of year, we're going to move into a lot of different holidays yeah. where there's a lot of buffets, there's a lot of food around and a lot of choices. I want you to see as I pour this out, this is a pound by the way. I'm gonna pour out just one pound and it's gonna fill this entire bowl. Now, what's great about this is as I look at something like this, and if I had chips sitting right here, yeah. and I had this sitting right here, naturally our eyes get drawn to the nature. Mm -hmm. We'll go right for it. This is a great time of the year, by the way, to have this and just have it out when you're, you know, your guests come over, yeah. um, you're having get togethers, tailgating, yeah. all of that sort of thing. This is fabulous for that but you do want to hide a little bit of it. You yeah. Know? And that's where you went wrong with your husband. Yeah, you got to hide it because my husband, same thing. It must be the, the yeah. guys really, really love this. Yeah. Um, but you know, I always hide 
a couple because yeah. if he knows exactly where they all are, they're right. gone. The, yeah. Like he just because you just say, so you just keep going. A little trick about nuts, and this is something that my um, my trainer told me, mm -hmm. um, and he said, please share this with everybody because he says this to all his clients. He says a handful of nuts is what he recommends before a party or a gathering. So okay. that would be about here. Okay. So a handful just like this is something that's going to help satiate you. Mm -hmm. What does that mean? There's a lot of different things we can snack on, mm -hmm. but not all things are, are equal. Right. You know, a lot of times I always talk about those 100 calorie snacks that yes. we all ran out and bought, and we yeah. said, sure, that sounds great. Yeah. The problem was they didn't have the fiber. Mm -hmm. They didn't have the things that satiate us, so you would eat like five of them. Yes. That's what happened to me. I yeah, eat one, and, and I'm like, I'm still not full. I'm right. still not full. <laughs> I'm still not full. Then it totally defeated the purpose. Nuts are loaded with fiber. They're loaded with protein. Then you have the antioxidants from the fruits. So what you're eating is actually giving you a satiating snack as opposed to something that's just a mindless eating type you that's know, situation. Right. So right. you do want to kind of, you know, keep track of how much you're eating of this. It's probably not, you know, you don't want to eat the whole container in one sitting. Yeah. Eat them a little bit at a time because what happens, and the, my trainer's tip, mm -hmm. eat a little bit of nuts before you go to like a buffet or yeah. dinner. Yeah. Because you'll eat less. You'll eat less. That's right. Because these are satiated. And, and it's a snack that, or you can use it as a snack that you don't have to feel guilty about. Yeah. You can use it in other ways too. I even love that they were used uh, as ingredients yes. in some of what we've got so here. So many fun things to do with your Ferris and you guys have given me lots of great ideas over the years, but cookies is you know one of the ways that people love to use this because you can literally just drop some Ferris right into your cookies and it's delicious. Pancakes, it's so super simple. We did some pancakes. Pound cake, which is what you're seeing right there. Um, um, you know, cupcakes, yeah. which um, you know how easy just to drop them into your cupcakes. I love to put it on my salad. Mm. because a salad or like a yogurt mm -hmm. those are two things that you actually in the store will pay extra money for that little cup on the side yeah. that has like the nuts in it but it's always like a low quality nut or something and yep. you can kind of taste it like yeah. there's some kind of preservatives or something in there yeah. and then it just never it, and it's like okay yeah. when you put ferris on your salad mm. when you put ferris on your parfait i love parfaits because they're a fast breakfast mm -hmm. mine don't always look this pretty thank you olga <laughs> for a beautiful parfait um <laughs> uh, mine are usually like just like whoop, i put like a whole bunch of yogurt real quick and i just right. put my nuts on top yeah. but what happens is it gives me the yogurt is is great you know greek mm -hmm. yogurt so great and then to have just um the nuts on top really fast gives me the crunch but again it's the satiating That's breakfast right. that is fast that i can run out the door and feel really good yeah and and again guilt-free and this is the idea that's why we put these on auto ship so that mm -hmm. once you start eating them because they are not going to be like those mixes that you just go out and buy in the store or that impulse mix that you see right there at the cashier's you know station these are the ingredients and the way that they're sourced and the places yeah. that Ferris goes to source their ingredients is literally all over the world. Yeah, and here's our factory actually in Grand Rapids, Michigan, so that's where we're based. So I want you to think about how many companies you know nowadays that have been in business for 94 years yeah. and what that means. And this is a family-owned business, so we are so excited with every single order. We really take it serious. We really love you. We really mm -hmm. wanna make sure that you keep coming back. Mm -hmm. And so it's, it's an exciting thing. Every time I've been at the factory when orders are coming in, um, and you know that it's a lot of care that's yeah. going in to this we do everything fresh so when your order comes in today that's when we're packing it is today mm. so we close each one of those containers and then we're shipping it out to you and that's really important because if you go to the store and that's what's in my hands right now yeah. this is from the store this is from ferris if we start looking at like a little individual degree side by side you notice a difference immediately yes. you start to see that you know little little chopped up pieces little tiny cashews those little dried up fruits not with Ferris. The difference is huge. And, and you know, that's why we're in our eighth year here at HSN. Mm -hmm. And, you know, the reason it's just once you taste it, if you've right. never tried this, this is something you must experience. And mm -hmm. it is an experience. I did not realize before Ferris mm -hmm. that nuts are supposed to have notes like wine does. Oh! So each nut, you know, when you're eating a pecan versus eating a cashew, you know, cashews are supposed to be buttery and kind of, I almost call them the meaty nut to mm -hmm. me. They because are. they have like, that. you just taste it as it's going down and it's really giving you that protein. But like a pecan mm -hmm. kind of has that different flavor and when they're whole like this and they're not cracked up you're going to get the oils inside that you're supposed to That's taste right. and then right they're not dried out and then the almonds you know there's a certain these are california almonds they're going to give you that certain taste that and that's the number one place to get um, almonds from 
all of a sudden you go, whoa, I'm not just mindlessly grabbing a huge handful and just chomping them down. Mm -hmm. I'm tasting each one. Or maybe what? I like to eat a cherry with a cashew. Yeah. Or maybe, and it, and it becomes an experience. And that's what I think, you know, Ferris has done an amazing job of that I, I love that we get to share that with you. Agreed. So. And you can slow down because you're eating each one at a time. You can yeah. slow down and you don't have to eat as fast. Whereas with the other handful that you had, because they're just like, pieces what? of something, yeah. you don't even know what it is. And you're yeah. like, was that a banana or was that a pecan? Well, speaking of, I mean, like yeah. over here, you know, like this is the kind of thing they'll put the little banana chips in there or yeah. what have you. Or like over here, I think I have a, oh yeah. The little like this is like a little pineapple-y guy. If you hadn't told me, I would have thought it was an eraser. <laughs> okay, but you know, I mean, I can like I'm I'm pressing on this as hard as I can. It has not changed shape, you guys. Um, and so that you should get your crunch from your nuts, no, not, not from <laughs> fruits. <laughs> and that's the difference. You know, I can come over here and I can go into my bowl and go to any one of our cherries. But when I press on our cherry, mm -hmm. what's going to happen? It's going to smush right into my hand. Yeah. And again, I did it on the other one. I'll do it on this one too. I can actually see like yeah. it pulling apart. You just saw that, right? Yeah. And then when it goes onto my hands, I mean, my hands are filled. It's sticking to me. They're filled with juice. Right. It's an incredible experience. You're getting three pounds of it. And I love that they're individually yeah. containered like this because... Yeah. So this is what I say. You have one at home, right kind of where you watch TV. And then you have one at the office. And what I have learned is you keep the third one in the pantry, like, hidden. Yes. Because if you tell <laughs> hubby that you've got three pounds, guess what? They're going to be gone really quick because they're just that good. Yeah. So whether it's your... You know, you know, you're putting these on your, you know, yogurt or your ice cream, using them as ingredients or eating them straight out of the container. You're going to enjoy the quality of every crunch. Let mm -hmm. me share with you. Yes. We've got, um, what was that? The, the, so your choices are the cherry and cranberry or the blueberry and cranberry. Right. And you can get them roasted and salted or raw and unsalted. Um, and you can choose them once, or you can get them coming on auto ship. And you can, and what's great is that you can keep the free shipping on auto ship. We will have to move on. We will keep these okay. available for you. But just know if you want the blueberry with the cranberry, um, those are gonna be the most limited and those are gonna be the ones that go first. And I'll okay. tell you our blueberries, yum. I know. Even and if you're not big. a big blueberry fan, let me tell you, yeah. try these. They're pretty cool. And the only difference between the cher regular cherry berry is we take out the cherries yeah. and we give you blueberries. And blueberries, we know they're so good for us, too. Huge in antioxidants. Yes, yes, absolutely. So you don't have to feel guilty. Go ahead and you can shop with a 097976 is the number to get those home. And uh, we would love to send those right on out to you. All right. <laughs> I'm like, oh, let's go. <laughs> so Carrie's staying with us because, she, because she's got, um, that was my husband's favorite the Ferris uh, Cherry Berry Nut Mix, and this is my favorite, cupcakes. And these are from Holstein, and what's great is that you are making your own cupcakes. You're getting from Holstein the Fun Collection 12 Cupcake Maker. And so if you wanna make vanilla cupcakes, chocolate cupcakes, red velvet, carrot cake cupcakes, whatever, cornbread cupcakes, oh, yeah. you can do all of that here. Yes, you this can. is a big customer pick. It's been very, very popular because it warms up in two minutes, they bake in seven minutes, and you're eating cupcakes. Yeah. And we're showing you, this is the black one. We also have it in magenta and also in mint. That's how you're gonna choose your color. But let's go in and talk about why this is a customer pick, why it's so popular. Well, you know what? I mean, the thing is, in less time than it takes to heat up your oven, mm -hmm. you've already got 12 cupcakes that you're you're done with, okay? And then the second thing that I love about Holstein is we're all about making it easy and fun in the kitchen, right? So every one of our makers has nonstick top and bottom. And what that means is I just did an entire batch in here. And if you look in here, there's maybe a couple little crumbs, yeah. but it's virtually clean. It almost looks like nothing happened here. Right. And that I love because when I have appliances that are easy to clean, I'm a happy camper. Because if you get something and it's hard to clean, you know what happens, the same thing that happens to me. It ends up like, in the garage somewhere. That's right. So we're in the back cabin. At the garage sale. Exactly. You're just like, I hate this thing. Okay, so what's great about this, super easy, super fast. I'm gonna go ahead and fill, you know, with some of my chocolate here, and then I'm gonna go to do vanilla here. And that's what I just took out was different flavors. So okay. you don't have to, of course, do just the same flavor all the way across. Mm -hmm. You can do various multiples on this one. I'm actually gonna do two at Ooh, once. Swirl. Uh-huh. So, 
you can get real creative with this. And I'm actually gonna stop right there and, and say that's it. I only wanna make nine this time. You don't have to fill every single cavern. You can just do two. Mm -hmm. You could do one if you just got a cupcake fix and you need one yeah. that night. And it's not gonna affect the way they bake. At all. It'll absolutely still come out. And look how perfect that these are. I mean, I can go to any one of these and they're perfectly brown top and bottom. They come out in that perfect shape. I didn't have to put any cups in there. I didn't have to do anything special. Mm. And there you go, super ooby, like spongy, which is yeah. what you want, and perfectly cooked. So, you know, baking is a very precise science. Yes, it is. I was never very good at it, to be honest. <laughs> Holstein has helped me become much better than I ever was, but it makes it easy. And I think that that's what it's all about. So whether you are working with a grandchild, a mm -hmm. child, mm -hmm. maybe you're just not like really big on baking and you say, but I wanna be, Yeah. you know, then this makes it easy. Or if you do a lot of baking and you need to move faster. Oh my. I love this for that. I so. love, you know, because a lot of times, especially like around now, around the holidays, your oven is occupied with the turkey and everything else, yep. the dressing and the macaroni and all that stuff. Um, and you wanna, fr and so, you don't have space in there to then go ahead and bake your cupcakes. True. But with this, now you don't need to busy the oven and you don't need to warm up the big oven. Look at how fast and how perfect they are. Every single one. And you know, I always like to point out too, sometimes I'll make a mess on purpose and I'll like go out of the lines, you know? Yeah. With this, you can do that because it's non-stick, remember? So mm. no matter what, even if it went over a little bit, it's gonna peel right out. That's actually what I call my snacks. Okay. So while I'm making <laughs> these, I peel those out and I say, oh, those imperfections are my snack. Yeah. So as I go, but you know, this is great for the bake sales. Um, mm -hmm. If that's for you this time of year, mm -hmm. um, again, tailgating parties, um, you know, a lot of people, you know, still there's gonna be those fall weddings and, right. and get togethers, those baby showers. Yeah. Those are all year. What's that yellow one? Um, so this is just, we just used um, different food coloring. So this is just our oh. rainbow configuration here that we did. How great is this? <laughs> but you could just use your own food coloring and you know, whether you wanna make it yourself or you buy it in the store, there's tons of different ways to get different colors, but you see how it just became a complete rainbow. So Over here, we even did, uh, you know, hey, what's coming up next? Halloween. Halloween. So right here are our cute little candy corn guys and our little pumpkin guys. And you know, that's where this can then become even more fun when you start mm. decorating. So I'm gonna fill with some okay. strawberry and some red velvet it and then we're gonna do some decorating right and and the thing is this you you'll see how easy they are to fill but is it this is just as easy as plugging it in and yeah. waiting for it to warm up and go two yeah. minutes two minutes and you know what you'll notice and we'll show you it in, in just a second there's there's no timer that you need to set there are no buttons that you need to press you plug it in it warms up when it's ready the light will change color and then you fill it and when it's done baking the light will change color that's it it's that simple i think that's part of the reason why this has been such a big customer pick is because it is so easy and you know the results you're going to get because if you are a baker the worst thing is to spend all of your time by expensive ingredients put them all in the oven and then cross your fingers and hope it exactly. comes out right. Exactly, and you're like, oh no, I hope it works out. Yeah. Um, on this one, so I'm getting down to the bottom, but here's what I wanna do. Look, oops, uh -oh. okay, I did that on purpose. So when I do that, I'm showing you what happens. This is gonna crimp down as it comes down and no matter what, your cupcakes are gonna be perfect and that little extra that I went oopsie and I kinda went over, it's literally gonna peel right out. Perfect. And so every time, you cannot mess this up. Mm -hmm. That is the biggest thing I could tell you. That's why it's great working with kids on something like this and getting them used to being in the kitchen. Yeah. I say it's also fun to do with friends. So like when I have my girlfriends over, um, you know, maybe we have some adult beverages or, <laughs> um, you know, things like that. And in the holidays, I do um, baking oh. parties. Oh, that's nice. So, and how nice is that? And then everyone gets like one of those little, you get those little um, boxes. And so everyone can take home their favorite. Very nice. So then you just do some decorating. That if you want to. Cool. Here, this one can you, be yours. Okay. If you want to pick a top. Topping. So you could do cupcakes and cocktails with your girlfriends, okay, right? Then, yeah. You could do... A little of that. Maybe I'll just finish it off right here with some of this. Exactly. And as you're do. talking and having a good time, you're creating and you're making cookie. something fun. Maybe your favorite breakfast cereal. Mm -hmm. How many times have you gone to uh, a bakery and it has... Well, I should have put that on there better, but <laughs> it has your favorite breakfast cereal on there. That's all they did, and yeah. now they're charging you like a gazillion dollars what? for it. They'll... You could have done that at home if you had this. There are a lot of cupcake shops, and they're, you know, they might be gourmet cupcake shops, but you'll, they'll charge you two fifty per cupcake. Think about that. Yeah. When you're making twelve of them, and you've got a price break on these, normally this was about fifty dollars. Mm -hmm. Today you've got it for thirty four ninety five for flex pay of $8.74 
and you've got your choice of color. So this is the mint you were seeing. We had the magenta and we were also working with the black. There was another color, but it's already gone. Yep. So these sell out quickly because they're so easy. And what I love too about these is that it's portion control. Because yes. if I make a cake, You'll Guess what, Carrie? I'm going to eat a cake. I do that, too. <laughs> um, and it's, it's too big of a piece. And then I feel yes. bad afterwards. And then I have and to I'm even like, it up. I'm like, like oh, no. And like then before you know it, you're like, I ate the whole cake. Okay, right. so with this, yeah, it really is about portion control. And, and again, they're always that perfect size. This is our um, muffin mix, actually, that we just did, like a mixed muffin. Nice. So take your favorite muffins that you enjoy. Maybe it's your own recipe. We're going to actually start you off with 15 recipes in the book. So mm -hmm. we're actually giving you uh, this recipe book that has uh, its color completely mm -hmm. color so we're giving you 15 recipes three icing recipes so if you want to make your icings from scratch of right. course you can do box mix as well so yeah. if you want to you know get into the big box store and get yeah. your box mix you can do that that's totally fine but maybe you want to get even more expressive and you say I want to you know toy with this and have fun and, and come up with my own recipes yeah it does inspire you anything that you need to cook all the way around you can place in here place an egg in here mm. place um you know um actually at the end of the table yeah. um look at over there we yeah. have so there's a store in most malls that you go to they sell those uh cinnamon things yes right? okay you can make those in these so this is just from the cold food section you just snap it open mm -hmm. and you just put them right into the caverns that's, oh, that's it. it that's it and they bake just like that so they come out in that perfect form yeah. and then you just put your favorite you know uh, cream cheese icing on there so so oh i like that so you know oh so could i do this could i put maybe four of the cinnamon rolls in there and then maybe some egg there as yeah, well. You totally can. And then maybe, you know, whatever whatever it is, you know, that I want to put in there. And then in seven minutes or so, I have a full breakfast. You absolutely do. And all I had to do was plug this in. It warms up in two minutes. And then in about seven minutes, your cupcakes are baked. Perfect. And you're done. Isn't you're that great? eating. This is, this is great. This is why it's so exciting. This is why Holstein makes it simple. Yeah. And these are the kind of things that, whether you're doing it or you are getting the kids or the grandkids or the nieces and nephews involved, you just can't go wrong. And nope. there, there's no disappointment in the end because they're always gonna turn out right. Okay, so I wanna get into this, so let me see how good I can do this because it is hot, okay? Be careful. This is my, mm -hmm. let me make sure I'm getting the right one, yes. Okay, so this is my sausage and peppers corn oh. muffin oh it's very hot so don't put gosh. down okay <laughs> so we put sausage and peppers in there that's it this okay. over here oh you changed it up is my jalapeno oh. and cheese muffin so haha -ha, yes very hot guys jalapeno oh. and cheese so you see it actually has that cheesy thing oh, yeah. happening oh yeah i, I need some so, chili for that one <laughs> I had even put macaroni and cheese inside of these. Oh my gosh. Uh, you could put a hot dog inside of cornbread. And so if you got your hot dogs earlier this yeah. hour, you could do that by all means. Okay. Um, so, you know, this just opens up your mind. It gets you creative. You have a lot of fun with it. Again, it cooks from top and bottom. There's nothing you need to do. You don't need to flip anything. You don't need to worry about it. You just come back in about seven minutes right. and you're going to check. And usually about seven minutes, you're done. Yeah. And that's it. And then you're just going to take them out and let them cool. That's it. That's it. And remember, all you did was plug it in. There's nothing, there's no button to press. You nope. don't have to remember to press the button or nope. remember to turn off the alarm. Um, you're going to kind of hear it you know, or, and see the, the um, light change. You've got just a red light and green light on top. Mm -hmm. So it's very, very simple for you to do. You can make 12. You can make two. Yeah. Um, and the idea is most of us, if we're just going to make a couple, two or three or four cupcakes or muffins, we're not going to, we're going to say, you know what, I just won't do it. I won't fire up the oven for that for right. two or three or four. But this, but easy. This, it's two minutes and you're, and you're eating great. Um, I do recognize there are a lot of you calling in and we are in sl a slight hold situation. So just hang in with us, we'll get there very quickly. Or if you're near your computer, go to hsn.com and um, you can type in this item number. It's 514589. And you can go ahead and order yours in black, in mint, or in magenta. And we'll send it right on out. And Look at this. You so you see, in some cases, I'm yeah. running out. Okay, so maybe I'd ha you'd have another batch, or maybe i say, okay, I only want to make nine, I only want to make ten. Whatever. If you want to make one, this will work the same no matter what. The hardest part, close it, lock it. Mm -hmm. That's it. That's yeah. all you have to... There's no heavy instructions. It wraps up. The cord actually wraps onto the bottom, and it stores upright, so it doesn't take up a huge amount of space. You can always just store it right into your cabinet. Let's go back and see and how what, our cupcakes are doing. And when I want to clean it, what do I do? 
wipe it down. So let it cool off yeah. and then just take a rag and wipe it down. That's really all that you have to do because again, it's non-stick. So you don't have to worry about doing a ton of work. <gasps> oh my gosh. So here's the cupcakes that we just started a few moments ago and there's my marbleized guys Ooh. here. Okay, so these guys are looking good. So I'm gonna let them cool for just a second okay. a little bit. Um, I think I actually wanna give them about 30 more seconds. Okay. Um, and that's the thing. You'll look and see kind of like where you want them to be over here. Ooh. Oh good. I wanna show you guys because remember I made my mess on, on purpose. Yeah. Watch what happens. That just pulls. Do you see this? Right off. It just pulls right off, okay? And these will come right out. So, again, this is something that makes baking easy. Yeah. And you don't have to worry about all, uh, being precise with everything. Yeah. And then, once you're done, you're like, what then are you going to do with this cupcake? Creative. You know what I was just thinking, too? Um, you, what you can do, because these are just the perfect size, you can cut them in half, like you know, um, the long the, the long way. Yeah, like a sandwich? So like a sandwich. Put some a scoop of ice cream in the middle oh if my you gosh. want to. Or maybe you just Stop. squirt in some like some melted chocolate or some caramel. Or is that just me? <laughs> Uh, that is not just you. Or, um, you. I mean, there's so much that you can do with these, and that's why cupcakes really have been kind of risen, you know, arisen to the level of being gourmet because I there's agree. so many different ways that you can adorn them. Oh, and you can, do? again, it comes along with that instruction booklet that does have recipes in it, How but fun. it's perfectly acceptable. We do this all the time at my house. You buy a box recipe or a box, you know, mix. Yeah and you just doctor it up. You add in a little something. You maybe add in a little, you know, I'm the queen of cinnamon. I'll just maybe sprinkle in a little cinnamon in there. That's I cute. love like gingerbread muffins. Wouldn't that be great with your pumpkin oh, spice Oh yes, latte? we have spice. I totally miss my spice, but I do. I have this, the, the ginger spice here. So you know, this time of year, we're gonna get into the pumpkin spice. So you can pumpkin spice it up over here and do some really fun things. And like I said, keep in mind, your imagination, you know, we're gonna get you started with 15 recipes and then your imagination, take it to the to the heels. And let me know what you're doing with it because mm. certainly we love to show off. Look how cute this <laughs> so is. We did, we did a little Swedish fish mm. on this one. So this is really cute. So think about like, you know, kids parties, um, again, the holidays and things like that. So, you know, we did our little candy corn one over here. Oh, that's so sweet. You know, and you can really get super creative. If you do wanna get those little wrappers to put them in just for decorative purposes, you can, yeah. but like, I imagine like I have this whole little area here where I have all my little ingredients mm -hmm. and this is fun. Like this is something that you'll get you back and if you're looking for a way to get the family back in the kitchen and yes. get everybody off of their technical things. Yes. You bring this out, you plug it in, it all of a sudden becomes the place everybody wants it. What are you making? Because you can smell them, right? Nothing better than a baked good. Mm -hmm. So as soon as you smell it <laughs> happening, I'm like, mm -hmm. you're like, yes. <laughs> oh my gosh. So this is so good. And and like we said, it doesn't have to just be for dessert. You might be thinking, well, I like cupcakes, but I don't eat them all the time. Sure. I love the muffins that you made. And yeah. I kind of jokingly said, I need some chili to dip it in because cornbread muffins with chili and jalapeno and cinnamon rolls and- It's perfect for stew season. You've got it all, you've got it all. We're so used to now kind of our one pot um, cooking. Yeah. We do want things to be more convenient and easier and easy to clean and easy to put away. I'm all about that. This is it. Oh my gosh, see? <laughs> That's so good. Yeah. Harry, thank you. You're welcome. For Taking sure. This one with me. I know the whole crew is like, yeah, thank They're you. They're all lying <laughs> us right now. Yeah, lots so. of cupcakes. All right, we've got so much more coming up. We've got a full hour of pry on the other side of this and we're gonna take a look at our today's special at that time. in Beauty Week is back with colorful new ideas and straight up favorites. The latest from brands you'll only find here and exclusives from favorites you love like Benefit, Beekman 1802, Smashbox, Too Faced, Essie, and many more. Come back every day for a limited time steal up to 50% off and get four flex pay on all beauty all week long. Best in Beauty Week only on hsn.com. 
The thing I love most about shopping at HSN. Do I have to pick just one? I'd have to say FlexPay. Mm -hmm. It allows me to get the things I want now and make monthly payments without any interest or fees. I got a new mattress for the guest bedroom, a fabulous cookware set for my sister's wedding, and a little something just for me. FlexPay gives me the flexibility to buy what I need now without the stress of having to pay for it all at once and no interest. Beat that layaway. Here at HSN, we base our retail values on nationwide information. Retail value is an indication of the price you would expect to pay for the same or similar item elsewhere, not the price at which you would be able to sell the item. Prices do vary around the country, so ours might be different from prices in your area. For more information, call one of our customer service reps at 1-800-284-3900.